Bronchiolitis is a common lung infection in young children and infants. It causes swelling and irritation and a buildup of mucus in the small airways of the lung. These small airways are called bronchioles. Bronchiolitis is almost always caused by a virus. Bronchiolitis starts out with symptoms much like a common cold. But then it gets worse, causing coughing and a high-pitched whistling sound when breathing out called wheezing. Sometimes children have trouble breathing. Symptoms of bronchiolitis can last for one to two weeks but occasionally can last longer. Symptoms For the first few days, the symptoms of bronchiolitis are much like a cold. 1. Runny nose 2. Stuffy nose 3. Cough 4. Sometimes a slight fever Later, your child may have a week or more of working harder than usual to breathe, which may include wheezing. Causes Bronchiolitis happens when a virus infects the bronchioles, which are the smallest airways in the lungs. The infection makes the bronchioles swollen and irritated. Mucus collects in these airways, which makes it difficult for air to flow freely in and out of the lungs. Bronchiolitis is usually caused by the respiratory syncytial virus, RSV. RSV is a common virus that infects just about every child by two years of age. Outbreaks of RSV infection often happen during the colder months of the year in some locations or the rainy season in others. A person can get it more than once. Bronchiolitis also can be caused by other viruses, including those that cause the flu or the common cold. Diagnosis Your child's healthcare provider can usually diagnose bronchiolitis by the symptoms and listening to your child's lungs with a stethoscope. Tests and x-rays are not usually needed to diagnose bronchiolitis. But your child's provider may recommend tests if your child is at risk of severe bronchiolitis, if symptoms are getting worse or if the provider thinks there may be another problem. Treatment Bronchiolitis usually lasts for one to two weeks but symptoms occasionally last longer. Most children with bronchiolitis can be cared for at home with comfort measures. It's important to be alert for problems with breathing that are getting worse. For example, struggling for each breath, not being able to speak or cry because of struggling to breathe, or making grunting noises with each breath. Because viruses cause bronchiolitis, antibiotics, which are used to treat infections caused by bacteria, don't work against viruses. Bacterial infections such as pneumonia or an ear infection can happen along with bronchiolitis. In this case, your child's healthcare provider may give an antibiotic for the bacterial infection. If you are new at our channel, please subscribe our channel, it will be great support for us.